Uh, so today we are here for a new technique of how to change uh, a PDF using LibreOffice Draw, which is a completely open source and completely free software. Uh, I have this PDF file here. Uh, in this PDF file, I have a text. This is a text-based text PDF file, and I want to make changes in this file. Uh, what do I have to do to make those changes? I will just come to uh, the LibreOffice Draw. Click this. And once I open this LibreOffice Draw, I will go to Open and uh, guide myself to the files location, which in this case is, is the American Culture Guide file. When I open this, we will see that now all the text has turned into a clickable form, which it means I can just bring my cursor here and start typing, adding or subtracting a few things. Uh, I can always zoom in and zoom out using this, uh, whatever you call this. This is a slider of zoom in and zoom out. I want to make a few changes. For example, if I want to make change in this heading, I will just write something like the basics and let me zoom in the basics and the advancements and maybe I can try to walk an underline like this. I can do it or also just all of them look the same. So, and somehow I want to add something here and their cultures and traditions. So, I have made two changes in this document and now I want to save this document back to PDF. Now, at this point, there is a slight issue in this LibreOffice draw that it won't help you uh, save it directly from this point. There is no option to save it in PDF. But there is an alternate way and that's a very easy way. Come to the file and uh, click export as and export as PDF. It's very simple. Make sure the, all the pages are selected here and just click export. And then in here, change the name of the file. Any name you like and click save. Now when you click save, the PDF will open again. If you don't want to open it from this place, you can just come back to the location where you save this file again. I, it was here, in this case, LibreOffice. So I'll just double click it and see that all the changes that I've made there are actually saved in this new PDF, the basics and the advancements and the cultures and traditions. So that was a very easy trick uh, that can help you in your open source journey and make uh, that can help you make changes in PDF without using any advanced software or, or without even going online. You can always do it from your own uh, computer. So that's it, guys. And make sure to subscribe to this channel for uh, more advanced tutorials on uh, open source software. Thank you.